So well, uh, now to solve these questions or third questions, when uh, given the expansion of function 1 plus x whole to the power n divided by 1 minus x. So 1 plus x whole to the power n divided by 1 minus x minus 1. That's why 1 plus nx plus n into n minus 1 by factorial 2 into x square plus n into n minus 1 n minus 2 divided by factorial 3 into x cube plus up to dot 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 plus x to the power n and uh, and 1 plus x plus x square plus up to dot plus x to the power n plus x to the power uh, n minus 1 and n plus x to the power n plus 1. So that implies uh, x to the power n minus 2 and x to the power n. That's why uh, now now the coefficient of x to the power n is now the coefficient of x to the power n is x to the power n is that means 1 that means 1 1 plus n c1 n plus uh, n plus n c n n c n that means n c n that means 1 plus plus dot 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 n c n dot 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 plus n c n that's why uh, 1 plus 1 plus uh, n c 1 n c n into 1 square and 1 to the power n. So, 1 plus 1 whole to the power n equal to 2 to the power n. This is the uh, solution of x to the power n. Well, thank you so much and thanks for everybody and thanks a lot.